Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Osterberg501, and today I want to go over how you can easily go about getting some 389 item level rings that have some very strong proc effects. Now, this is going to be located in the Azure span, and you're going to be rep grinding for the Cobalt Assembly. And once you have max rank with this reputation, you're going to have the selection of one of three rings. You can only equip one at a time. They all have the same secondary stats, so crit haste, but the special effects is where these really shine. So one gives you a chance while taking damage to get a massive absorb shield. One gives you a chance while healing to restore an additional large amount of health. And the other one gives all of your spells and abilities a chance to deal a massive chunk of additional damage. And these are pretty big numbers. The damage one is 25k additional damage. It's a 71,000k shield. And it's almost 40,000 additional health on healing. And getting wrapped up with these guys, you also have a bunch of other stuff you can buy. You have more dragon rider customization. You have a bunch of cosmetics. And you have a handful of really good crafting recipes. But you're primarily going for these rings. And this rep is much easier to farm than what you would originally think. Now at this Cobalt Assembly area, all the enemies you're going to be facing are elites and they're all in pretty big packs. Now first off, while you're going up to this rep, you do have this small skill tree. You can purchase upgrades for this area with Dragon Owl supplies, depending on what rep you have. So you have things where you'll heal every time you kill an enemy. You have damage procs. You have a proc that sets off fireworks when you're the highest rank. So you have some additional effects you can buy here while you're repping up. But the way you're gaining rep is just killing these elite enemies. When you loot them, they'll commonly have rare or uncommon items that give you a certain amount of rep and you loot them off those enemies. But the really unique thing in this area is that anytime you kill an enemy, they have a chance to drop this orb that you choose out of a handful of different powers or different buffs to yourself. It's pretty much a non-class specific version of Torghast and how you're getting these powers. So you may be able to get a health boost or a mastery boost or a crit boost. So you can keep stacking those up. They last five minutes, but every time you pick up one of these powers you could choose from, one of the options is always to refresh all of the buffs you already have. Then you can get a bunch of other stuff like leave behind a trail of fire constantly that can damage you, but does a ton of damage to enemies. You can get increased leech. You can get epic powers that make 100% of the damage you deal heal you. You can get one that just fully makes you immune to damage for five minutes. So tons of cool powers here that just turns you into an absolute god. Now, if you're not a tank, you're going to need a group for this. But if you are a somewhat decently geared tank, you can go do this. Take the first few packs slow, get a bunch of powers. Then you'll easily be able to just solo this entire area. But there are dozens of groups going at all times to farm rep here. So I just recommend joining a group from the group finder. It's going to speed this up very quickly. And you should be able to get maximum rep within a couple hours pretty easily. And that's pretty much all you're going to do to get max rep and go get these incredibly strong rings. I would definitely recommend doing this. These rings are ridiculous. They're very high item level. And if you're doing any raiding on day one or any mythic plus or even PVP, this is probably going to be worth to go and get. It only takes a few hours. It's actually pretty fun. I think it's some of the most fun mob grinding that's ever been in WoW. So I definitely recommend you go and do this. The rewards are very much worth. But that's pretty much all I want to go over. So subscribe if you want to see more World of Warcraft or other MMO videos. Leave a like if you liked the video. Leave a comment down below what you guys think about this rep grind area. And thanks for watching.